You can also create a video from YouTube URL. This is good if you want to create a short form from your long form video. To start, click on the option to create a video from URL and paste the YouTube video URL. You can also upload a video file that you have from your computer. I will say only one thing about it. You can create a video from any URL from YouTube, but remember that if you use other creators content, you should make it transformable because you can get into trouble and have your channel shut down for just copying other people videos. Never copy a video that you didn't create and re-upload it. Respect the creator that worked on that content for long hours. After we've made that clear, let's see what happened next. After it transcribed the video, you get the whole thing. You enter a different studio than the one we had when we just inserted the text. This is because first you need to decide what the content for the video will be. Now you can highlight some sentences and it will cut these sentences as separate clips. Victor gives you limit transition time each month. For the started program, it is 600 minutes, which is 10 hours of content. For the pro plan, you get 1200 minutes, which is 20 hours of content. This is how many minutes you transcribe from any existing video or audio file, not how much you end up with. To edit the text, first, let's get rid of the silence and, and filler word. Victory does a good job with that. When you remove the silence, you can choose how long the silence should be cut from. The default is to seconds, but you can change it to whatever you like. Then click OK. Now you can click on the auto highlight if you want Pictory to do the work for you. On the next tab, you have the highlighted scenes you created. You can highlight yourself and get it into the script. From here, you can also download the transcription of the whole text. When you click on the highlight, you can choose to create a 30 seconds or one minute video, like a short. If it is more than one minute, it will not be considered as a short on YouTube. So you can delete sentence says to make it shorter than 60 seconds. Sometimes it's the transcribing make a mistake, especially when it comes to names. So read all of the transcribing to find the mistakes before you download it. You can change the text in the transcription by highlighting it and changing the text. If you want to change the dimension of the video to create short form content, then click on the portrait option. You can change the video text style from the transcribing tab. So if you don't need to edit more things, you can download everything from here. If you if you have styles for text you created, you can change them here. But if you want to create a new style, you need to go to the editor. For the subtitles, you can remove them, but it is a good idea to have subtitles on shorts as it is more engaging. You can also choose how many lines you are going to have on each scene in the subtitle. You can change it by choosing more lines in the button option. You can also change that in the editor afterwards, but it is better to do it here. Then you can go to the studio to continue editing. Click on the button on the top right and then you get into the editor studio. The editing process is the same as the other way of creating videos in Pictory. Because it was horizontal video and now it is vertical video, the size of the screen changes. So the best thing is to move the clips to the right position. Remember, it will change all the scenes that are connected. So if you want to unlink the scenes before changing the position of the video, do that by clicking on the link between the scenes that are connected. You will change the position for all of the scenes that are connected until that point. After you change the position, you can go one by one through the tabs on the side and customize each one as you wish. Another good idea is to change the text, font size, and color. Click on the style tab. You can use the templates they've made or create new templates for yourself. Remember to apply the changes to all of the video titles so it will look professional. You also can add music if the video didn't have one when you upload it. And you can add some emojis or even change some of the scenes if you like. If you want to change change the voiceover you have on the video from YouTube to some AI voice, then you can also do that. After you've created the project, transcribe and got into the video editing, you can go back to the transcribing by clicking on the previous button. Then it will delete all of the changes you have done with Pictory Editor, but you will have the chance to go back and change the video. You can duplicate the video on your project tab to save the video you like and then go back with the video you want to change. That way you are not going to delete all of the work you've done. Subscribe like and watch this video next.